people should be more considerate of what they say about the dead on social media. That is the message Tanisha Jackie's family once relayed to people who comment on social media. On Tuesday morning, the 19-year-old woman was killed on Arapita Avenue on Inwoodbrook while in the company of a man from St. Bob's. A spokesperson for the family who identified himself as Jackie's cousin, who prefers to remain anonymous, says, despite what is being posted on social media, their family knows better. It's on social media, but I won't go into detail, but as I say, on social media, some people just need to realize that let our family moan in peace and stop the speculation and the fake rumors about Tanisha's death. Company Tanisha Jackie's parents and an aunt to the Forensic Science Center in St. James. They described her as jovial and always fun to be around. 19 years, I don't really have a bad memory. Always fun, loving, and a really happy person. And that is the memory I would like everybody to leave she with. The family of two other women whose bodies were scheduled for autopsies on Wednesday opted not to speak with reporters. On Tuesday, 43-year-old Kalida Shamba and her 66-year-old mother, Kamalita Dillion, were at their home in Shoreland's Point Kumana Karanaj when a man known to them entered the house and shot them both. The suspect has since been apprehended by the police.